Hi there, so um, I want to show you how you can actually make nice product screenshots for your application. Um, so here I have my simulator window open. Make sure that this actually shows up to 100% so you can scale it back up, scale it up to 100% to get um, high quality screenshots. So that's a screenshot of one of our templates, the Radio Jive template. So now, so right now at the moment you have to take, take a screenshot of this. So if you go to file, save screenshot. So that's gonna save a screenshot to your desktop, right? So I already have a screenshot saved up here. So that's this one, that's the file there. So what you now wanna do is open up Photoshop. So that's the screenshot. So if you open up Photoshop and open up a template. So that's one of the templates which I downloaded. You can see, um, you probably see, I'll put some links to where you can actually download some of these um, templates, right? So in these templates, what you, so what you will find out is one of the layers is going to be the layout for the screen and it's going to be a smart object and then you can edit smart objects in Photoshop. So if I, that's my smart object here. So if I double click on that and I open the smart object, so now I can now paste my screen in here. You will see that the size is probably going to be the size of my screen. So that's a 640 by 1136. So that's an iPhone 5 screen. All right. So now I will open my screenshot in Photoshop. So if I drag that to Photoshop, so if I drag that, that's my son talking in the background. Anyways, uh, so I, I copy that and I paste the screen in there. So that's in there. And if I save this, so if I go to File, Save, then I close this, then go back to the to the template, you can see that we already have our screenshot in there. So um, that's looking kind of dark. So maybe if I change the background a bit to make it um, stand out. So if I um, hide that and I use the new background, that's that one. Or that one. Well, you can always mix and match depending on what you want. Right? So now you can see that I have my new product screenshot. So if I um, make that bigger, do command, command plus. So you can see, you can, you can now save this as a PNG file or you can crop this depending on how you want that to show up all right okay so thank you very much for watching this video um probably let me just show you how to crop it if i go, go file save oh sorry file save as and i'll choose a png option so if i go in here choose a png So in desktop we have the mockup.png so I can actually go in here and drag it and then put it in Photoshop or actually I can just open it directly in preview. So we have that. Alright, so that's a demo screenshot or that's a demo well, mockup done for your app. This actually looks very nice and then it can actually help you to present your apps better in the app store or in um, reviews or in product reviews. Alright, thank you very much for watching and um, let me know if you have any questions. Cheers.